okay the other day i was talking about uh, i don't want i don't want i don't want everything is done by somebody else immediately we had a beautiful uh, uh, colleague who is from my native sharaf he is a muslim core muslim he was there i said same thing is what is told in islam anything which happens immediately they will say inshallah right it's not done by me it's done by god everything is by god i have to meet you shall i join for the program will bhagavad gita class will start inshallah if god decides it will happen so everything is god decision he was there to learn and immediately asked him to sing a song he was singing only vedic mantras he has a small child 3 year 4 year old child maybe 3 years back now must be 7 year she sings fantastic and we have muslim songs this is actually intra faith the muslim sa- songs have got a very specific style in which they sing the style is entirely different it is not like even if you give a, a mantra to them they will chant in muslim style so i used to have participants in my camp those who are muslims christians so i'll give a song which praise ganesha i'll ask them to sing in muslim style immediately they will sing so we had a musician who used to have bhajans then in the camp next one muslim sang then christian song they have a very specific style after some time this person who was singing bhajan he forgot his tune he was only getting the other tune because that is more up- pleasing and appealing than the original traditional one hey. so what people should accept is they should uh, have different tune in which you can sing that is one of the additions of music Right. like gayatri mantra yeah. they have movie style now yeah even uh, different people will sing a different style but traditionally as per the grammar eight eight letters are called one meter in literature it is called one meter that will have to come together the next eight together you cannot split but many people split it as they like right. that's only rule otherwise the meaning itself may go even gayatri mantra as uh, dilip ji is telling om bhur bhuvaswaha tat savidur varenyam bhargo devasya dimahi न प्रचोदया 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 इज एनलाइटन न प्रचोदया इज नेगेटिव ऑपोजिट ऑफ दैट डोंट एनलाइटन मी सो इंस्टेड ऑफ सेइंग न प्रचोदया इफ दे से फिनिश्ड द एक्शन इज नेगेटिव बट लकीली एनीवे नोबडी इज गोइंग टू लिसन एंड देन प्रोवाइड यू इट्स ऑल विद इन अस ओनली dio yo many people will say dio yo na prachotayat meaning is wrong dio yo na prachotayat that's how it should say dio yo na dio yo na inside me prachotayat enlighten inside me otherwise it becomes dio yo with your light na prachotaya don't and that and negation comes there it's like uh, the judge gives no hang him not let him go hang him not let him go instead of that hang him not let him go <laughs> god is knower god is 
nowhere god is now here <laughs> cut the spelling w add here or there god is nowhere god is now here the small difference that's it we have togetherness we get together some people get to her no together get to her together is get to her <laughs> ട്രബിൾ <laughs> <laughs> is <coughs> the fine but lot of difference it makes lot of difference right and in our language so many things sometimes people say i forgot the words and totally meaning is different i like ama ama in tamil is different malayalam is language to language lot of things and more when i came to new york and brooklyn somebody said what's up i just look up sky what i don't know the slang you know <laughs> they didn't say what's hanging <laughs> and it still is very hard to understand what is the real english no actually i keep saying all westerners can say warm welcome but you cannot tell this in gulf because warm is not good for them you have to say cold welcome <laughs> don't tell any any place where it is too hot again warm welcome you should have only air condition welcome no warm welcome for westerners warm is good yeah when sun they will say good day beautiful wonderful day but here sun is there it's not wonderful rain is wonderful for us yeah right we enjoy rain more than sunlight because almost 8 months 240 days we have sunlight right it's really totally sunny water. so we cannot have afford warm welcome <laughs> we can afford only rainy welcome chilly welcome chill chill welcome that's good the celebrity in in like universal language now most of the greetings are like that right see everybody say hello hello what is hello alexander graham bell's girlfriend is your the way you address your father is also alexander graham bell's girlfriend's name right so if somebody say hello i will say no i am not hello i am dr tps hello yeah. already dead and gone yeah. say namaste namaskar that's it now there is a problem in one, one of the state in america in the school we cannot say namaste no greetings general is enough you decide what way you want me to address you right we had a great common dialogue best one is a smile <laughs> that's where it is over there lot of changes need to be people are going abroad different countries so if they have this common language it's easy even english also very high because here new york english is different other states are different style europe is different or 
Australia is different, Indian English is different. If they make like a one style, then people can learn and use in different places. But accent, accent also a problem. Yes, spellings differ. Yeah. That's why dictionary also we have Indian English, Australian English, other than American and Britain, right? Keep saying the native speakers are different and non-native language speakers speak different. Maybe uh, the Shakespearean English is entirely different, right? The spellings are different, the words are different. Even in our, our religious place, no fees. We use Malayalam itself. It's totally different. We cannot understand what they are writing. No, the, the English, the aristocratic original British English, that came from origin Latin and Greek. So if you look epitomology, you reach gra Latin and Greek. Most of the lexiographic Observations will tell you that all the technical terms in engineering, medicine came from origin from Europe, Britain, Latin, Greek, German, etc. Except computer science. The computer science is an American product. Therefore, you will see a barbarian, not sophisticated, colloquial young hippie language like boot the system what a stupid the word is this you instead of starting the system you can put your boot and then step on that no kill the process how can you kill a process <laughs> remove <laughs> remove arab short form is used arab remove no it's not technical word floppy which is never a floppy they used floppy even without a floppy. You cannot take a floppy and try to flop it. It doesn't work now. But still the word is used because once upon a time it was floppy. Understood? <laughs> so kill the process, boot the system, delete the word. All these are end, stop. All these are never technical words. These are all normal colloquial words. That is because the words are developed when the product is developed. Right. When you don't have a produce, you cannot generate only words. Nobody will take it. We have kappa, which is called the tapioca. So you will see a close relationship with the product and the... Maybe Brazil, they use a different word. But tapioca is an English word because it was coming from kappa. Coconut. I reckon it. All these products are Indian products. Pepper. So the word also came along with the product. So production is what is essential. If you have only language, no produce, it doesn't stay. That's why Vedic language, all that is still used by all the people in Sanskrit only. Instead of translation, it comes from uh, now Sena. Now Sena is Navy. Yeah. Similar, similarly, the numbers also. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. All these are 7. Sapta. 9. Now. Das, dasham. And another thing is about the Sanskrit, you know, people like to learn the Sanskrit. But actually language is useless if there are no communication in that language. Literature is entirely different. Okay. Those literature language is never spoken. Right. You cannot learn Bhagavad Gita and learned Bhagavad Gita doesn't mean you can colloquially use it. Because none of the Bhagavad Gita terminologies are usable in day to day life. So, language is different, literature is different. Understanding literature, you need not know the language. Literature is entirely different 
the words which are used in literature can be entirely different. That's why you know Shakespearean or maybe Wordsworth uh, poetry. That doesn't mean you are a good English communicator. A good English communicator may not even understand Wordsworth or Shakespearean poetry also. Otherwise, every English speaking people would have interpreted every poetry and uh, no. I may be able to speak in Malayalam, that doesn't mean I understand Malayalam literature. Correct. So, literature is entirely different. So, you understand the literature, Vedic literature, you need not know the Sanskrit language. Right. I remember when I was talking to Swami Murdayananda, you know, he wrote all the translations of Upanishads. So, I bought all of the stuff. Then I said, he asked me, is it easy? I said, for me, I am love of in my language, easy for me to understand. Watch them. So I like this book. And he, he was very happy. But when you look at the uh, English books or Sanskrit texts, yeah. when I read, I want to sleep. <laughs> Get bored, you know. Can read maybe one page, I understand after that one. But if I need read Mariela, go on and on and on. Gabriel, tom uh, tomorrow we have on astrology. One session. Day after tomorrow also something else is there. That's on education, Indian education. Maybe 17th onwards we have on making India better. Right. What India needs. We will end up by 31st July and 1st August we will start uh, if the plan goes well for Bhagavad Gita. Yeah, nothing is there. If you decide, we will... Uh... So, uh, August what day is finishing? 31st. 31st. Yeah, so so it will be every Sunday. That's good. Yeah. So, so how many Sundays will you get? August, September, October. Now 22. December. December, no? Up to December, 22 Sundays. Oh, that is good enough. And people can ask questions. 22 Sundays, yeah. We'll keep it for one and a half hour. Yeah. 7.30 Indian time to 9 o'clock. Yeah, that's good. Thank Gabriel has a smile inside. Smile inside can interpret in two ways. I don't care. Yeah, it's no, good. I very much care. I'm, I'm enjoying, especially what you said about literature right now. Okay, <laughs> you are still in, that is over. Now we are in Bhagavad Gita. <laughs> <laughs> Still, Gabriel is in literature. Yeah. We call it as tube light. In Indian tube light, it takes time to... Once you switch on, you will have to wait another two minutes for the flickering will happen. Because we have starters. Flickering starters. It's like old bike. As you start, you cannot start. You need to raise it. So take some time to push. Right. He has this nature, Jambin, before hearing and listening. Right? That is good. They are smart people. I apologize. No, it's smart. It is good to jump. I jump very fast. Before you speak, I will tell. This is what you mean to speak. I add words. Many times when somebody speaks, I will say what the next word he has to use. Because I am already into their ideas, no? When somebody wants to pack immediately, I will give you. Take this. This is what you need. Because you are in somebody's thoughts. It's good. Nice. That's called the, 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 you know how the predictions, no? 
దీర్ఘదృష్టి దీర్ఘదృష్టి i i i think part of it was that part of it was a little foolishness in trying to persuade you in understanding that i was very much not smiling for that reason but because i was very much enjoying i know and also i'm i'm a little uncomfortable because of the background noise that that was here before there's work being done in my apartment so i'm not able to unmute all the time so i i was just listening and enjoying very much just go be present any problem no problem i am enjoy my hand leg will get wet enjoy rarely you get that opportunity if it is dark very good rarely you get when somebody says electricity failed electricity gone gone i said how can you say gone because it came as many times it goes it is coming that many times when somebody say electricity failed that means after that it came otherwise only once it will fail why is it multiple times it failed multiple times it came in mathematics we have a formula called the open and closed open closed but when you learn higher mathematics we have cloped one side is open other is closed it's called cloped no it's actually a mathematical word closed and open that's called cloped c l o p e n cloped so world is full of cloped <laughs> some open some closed some closed some open i keep say there is a great philosophy gabriel learned from dr t p s philosophy once you miss a bus you are at public transport you are waiting for a bus once you miss a bus lot of buses will come you can get into any one of them once you get into a bus you missed a lot of buses <laughs> great philosophy like this <laughs> now i'll tell you extension of this in family life <laughs> once you get married finished you lost lot of chances <laughs> once you fail exams wonderful you can write lot of exams once you pass exams finished <laughs> peter is showing <laughs> so once you miss a bus you get lot of buses once you get into a bus you miss lot of buses my patent you will not see anywhere this is mine see generally it happens once the bus comes you get into that immediately you will see the other bus full free oh why did i got into this i could have taken that bus and that bus also will overtake this bus and go so you are still slow <laughs> you see yeah, i missed the bus which was going faster i am it every time life is like this all this happened like this. so i keep saying you stand in a bus stop ask the bus you go <laughs> i don't know what many bus should go some some day we wait for the bus we had to get the bus now and bus supposed to be there and bus delay and you see the bus is coming and three other in the back all will come at a time so all all of what you said it happened in that moment yeah this is how it happens see one we 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 get into one very specific program graduation program immediately hey, this program is not good i would have done something else in my life many people keep saying this is not the path i want that path would have been better that subject would have been better so i keep saying we are like a fly a crow which goes and sits in a ship which is anchored on the shore the ship goes now you lost the chance <laughs> you cannot fly back our life is like that the ship which takes us now how do we know where are we going we don't know 
ship goes we are also going so enjoy this time is very good wonderful whatever happening happening he he think think too much oh my god create create moments create moments moments will stay he come, comes to the city once in a week then he say oh would i can spend only 10 minutes we last time i came from columbus to new york because one of my friend who wa- was driving he said come there is a vacancy in the car his wife is there so i am also company he started driving when he reached almost new york only he understood his car can never be locked <laughs> lock is not working <laughs> but still we drove parked in the hotel stayed there his meeting was over in a day then he said tomorrow we will go to niagara so from there he drove to niagara all that without lock three four days so you need lot of no let it come whatever happens let it happen if you only think about that the whole drive is boring the whole dialogue becomes only that new york is boring niagara is boring he could have said yeah my car is not working let us get repaired then go back no he said chalo no nothing will happen let us go i i remember when we went to andhra to get black galaxy granny and we don't know where to go as per my architect said oh we'll get a uh, map we went to the shop there's no map all gone then we end up in bangalore airport to get a map <laughs> and we don't have the address i know everything we went to different place where is the black galaxy why black galaxy what is that we spend one week <laughs> going there and coming back but we met different people and their directors to different areas yeah. and we learn about the granite different types of granite in andhra the second time again we went then we found the galaxy where we get and talk we learn about the galaxy rocks then they ask oh you need a village officer certified paper to take it we had to come back on third trip we went here and what uh, 5000 square foot uh, galaxy sheets yeah generally rajasthan is famous right no yeah. um, for marble rajasthan is very popular certain granites but Here, black gal yeah no. kadappa 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 and such places kadappa stone bedam cherla there are different stones in uh, andhra yeah. and kadappa we went there we saw the kadappa stones we learn about different types of stone then we had to go more north the last time we got the uh, everything packed in the truck and the worker said oh you can go back to kerala we'll bring the load i said i know you want to bring the load <laughs> once we leave that's it and every checkpoint we had to give money to people bribe yeah bribe then we reach uh, in kerala not border by the palakade there's a border <coughs> and they kept our vehicle there then i had to argue with the officer at last we got and learn about granite and marble what is it <laughs> it took three trips and we don't know where we are going nothing we just drive 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 is our learning process so sometimes good to travel without knowing where we are going. freak out 
क्या गब्रियल फ्रीक आउट राइट कॉल्ड फ्रीक आउट फ्रीक आउट सो गब्रियल कैन स्पीक ऑन व्हाट इंडिया नीड्स या या इज इज गेन गेट इन टू ही लाइक टू कम टू इंडिया एंड ही ही वांट टू चेंज द इंडियंस नो 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 नॉट चेंज नो आई वांट टू चेंज माय सेल्फ बट um <laughs> definitely <laughs> definitely i want to learn as much as i can uh the, the 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 spirituality and the simplicity is what the west needs it's so backwards over here in terms of trying to make everything a construct and a program and uh it it, it it's it's uh it doesn't need to be so systematized as it is over here and in certain ways india i find uh is becoming systematized but what is, is what is wrong in india what needs to be changed you have not seen the poor part of india suffering no. sufferings we have uh, places were geographically 20 kilometers away but you have to travel 200 kilometers to reach there across the across the river you will see the place but no bridge bridge is 100 km away and 100 km to travel it takes 5 hours not 1 hour so 20 km geographic but you take 10 hours to reach there difficult terrains you have problems of border there are places where people cannot own their land they are there for last life long but they cannot purchase land there because land restrictions because the border problems we have how many years now 75 years we are fighting with the neighboring country for not having a border drawn perfectly we have different states speaking different languages once i cross he won't understand my language we have people coming from different state coming and staying in small villages of mine where he can't understand the language he is only a labor you will see the train comes the full train full rush people run and got into that so many so many and even they travel on the top of that yeah top of the train still there are human pulling somebody else bullock cart animals cart medicines are not there 50 nearly 30% of the people don't even have electricity maybe 50% people are not connected on to internet lot of issues no health system by government for security health insurance is not there no social security no such facility only 20 percentage will have health insurance 80 percentage of the people without health insurance and full of mosquitoes flies so oh, that mosquito story i told you in kochi the best most capital Yeah, stinking smell cities are generally when we know we are reaching city because of the smell you go to best spiritual place like ganga after covid dead bodies were floating and that is the river we say the best river where people take bath for getting moksha because poverty money money matters money matters and lot of population that's the biggest problem yeah. how do we how do we restrict population that's a big problem government is facing everybody is thinking about it very seriously but some 
part of communities are thinking how do we increase our population so that we become more and stronger yeah. while getting married the blessings are given produce maximum children so that our community will grow faster can you imagine it's competitive and yeah so there are a lot of it's not as glossy but with all these also very strong very comfortable 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 live together mm-hmm. yeah people work people family, help family values yeah family values social security government need not give but when somebody is sick immediately everybody contributes we 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 give donations that's part of helping somebody else when somebody is on the road we will stop the vehicle pick him up take him take to hospital everybody does it everybody cares the other fellow maybe sometime we care more yes we'll keep asking how are you how are you how are you keep on asking those who are not used to that they will feel why are you involving in my affair when people stay outside and then come back they feel this is getting too much of care so people social care if there is a flood in the city next day everybody will clean social service is not a punishment here everybody likes to do it so if there is a flood there is a problem everybody involves with the government they don't ask it's not my job it's government job no it's everybody's job if there is a traffic jam not police alone everybody will be part of it clearing the traffic jam they can we can do it but i don't think in america when traffic jam is there i cannot get out he will shoot me right they say it's not my problem yeah that's all they say no no here. but here it's our problem right. and the political parties there are hundreds of parties everybody has got his own party i can start a party tomorrow start collection take money involved do strike in gulab sindabad normal well known word is in gulab sindabad hit yeah. the air up keep on hitting the air up one poet said you were hitting the air up for so long but the air did not go up still it is coming down. <laughs> why are you wasting your energy the thinker of fighting so some days we have like a tour program suddenly a strike will happen and you cannot go anywhere you stuck no if yeah. there is there is nobody on the road you must think that there is some problem because generally roads are crowded if there is nobody on the road that means hartal hartal means if you get into the road people will smash you and no police will protect you on a hartal day bandh day everything is locked locked down one political party decides today no vehicle will run in sakandrabad and if somebody runs the other fellow can go and puncture your vehicle hit you dam anything can be done no police police will just look at it let him do what he wants i am not involved because politics is more stronger politics is more stronger than administration need to be changed last good done today yeah yeah is yeah. done but politics is totally involved with religion therefore politics also is run by religion that is why every politician is generally in interfaith community because he has to please every every religious people so india is very strong in interfaith every political fellow in the they are interfaith people but only thing they have different party different interfaith <laughs> as many with parties with exception of marx eh huh? with the exception of marxism no no marxist also interfaith they are the best interfaith yeah. uh-huh. they have no faith the inter ill faith you have to add one ill there inter ill faith intro <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
you will get more people if you say ill faith community they ask your religion they will say nil n i l in the application form where you have to fill up they will not fill up and we have common names somebody's name is napoleon oh yeah common name napoleon mark marx marx lenin all different names are here yeah good so we ended up in uh, interfaith only right that's what we wanted interfaith discussion the faith you are part of the life faith to faith i was i was talking in the seminary class in the morning and one guy was singing he starts with me song you know but so I, i i told them i'm i'm glad i am he- hearing this music because gandhi used to teach us he start begins with us they took it as their own moment as it was already started you know? maybe instead of interfaith or intra faith intra fake f a k fake <laughs> Earlier people used to have inter-religious. Intra. Actually, inter-religious is not there. They are, everybody is inter-religious. Right. We want intra. Now, now they have uh, inter-spirituality. Yeah. I don't know. Spirituality is not to be cut into pieces and colors. Correct. Spirituality is spirituality. No so frequency. What? it goes straight no vibrations at all no. No, then then i said told them you, know, you see the difference <laughs> it's a different um, gabriel uh, you could download my book life made simple in which spirituality cannot be measured there is one title there spirituality cannot be measured i wrote long back because that day i went to some place like this some religious place where somebody was giving a lecture he was talking about how do you grow spirituality i said uh, there is nothing like you can put a lot of water and make spirituality grow lot of chanting your spirituality grows no because you put lot of vibhuti change your dress spirituality doesn't change everybody by birth is spiritual but later we dilute it and then lose all that that's why i said the spirituality is as you take wake up from the sleep the good smell is there in your faith you are spiritual the god gives a full rest blooming the blooming young children as they wake up they are really cute smooth right there is there is glowness in them but if you can retain it good amrutasya putro that is what bharatiya shastram says amrut is the nectar everybody is like a nectar by birth good dilip ji yeah thank you everyone see you i'll see if i can get peace slides on as many as possible Right. So, every, all the people should be Indian origin, correct? Not necessarily. If they look for India's betterment, it's fine. Right. We need to look like a half Indian, you know. Mix. <laughs> every... Indian by love. <laughs> That's it. Anybody who... Correct. What changes we need in India? So, uh, another idea I thought, when T.P. mentioned about the Gita, you know, maybe we can have a Gita class once a week. 
that will so, be good yeah discussion and all this thing like 18 chapters we can have uh to week means at least you get uh, how much time we need for one chapter to finish it depends do we need only a brief or line by line word by word uh, generally what do i prefer is to take uh, not all slokas are beautiful and good okay. first chapter is really boring that is why most of the people end up not learning. <laughs> because you start reading descriptions of Warfield, who likes it? So I believe second chapter is the core of Bhagavad Gita. If that can be, and not all the slokas also, many are repetitions in Bhagavad Gita. So if you take some 10 15 slokas, first chapter can be finished, second chapter can be finished. Like that, pick up few slokas which are most, mostly widely popular so that you feel, yeah, I know Bhagavad Gita now. Then start adding small, small. Maybe second chapter, ninth chapter, eighteenth chapter. Major. Major. They can be finished. You will feel, yeah, I know Bhagavad Gita now. So I, I was thinking if we uh, focus on the major part and just briefly mention about the other part. Yeah, that will be definitely will happen because we will connect all the slokas. Now, last week I did uh, one program that was to introduce the cleaning process in Vedic mantras. Most of the slokas which are popular different people added oh i know this so they chanted most of them are repetitions because different deities use different slokas essence is same but what i have what i practice is without any deity the core panjabudas so if you know that you know all the other slokas because they are all derived from them but most popular is for each deity, for some, for Shiva, some, for something else. Like that. So cleansing, cleansing is most important. How do you shred your ego? How do you clean your emotions, intellect, body, so that you can slowly get into the path of spirituality? I think all religions, only there is one path, but that path is clean, egoless, pure mind, but many people don't understand, they only end up in rituals which without understanding this is the path for reaching there. They are only working there in a small level in the nest without understanding the, the whole purpose of it. That is where it is lost. So that, that means uh, we have August, September, October, November, December. We have five months. So every, every week? We can have. Saturday or Sunday? Any, any day. Any time. So with this weekend, uh, then more people may join from abroad. Yeah. yeah. So maybe it will be focused on Saturday. Yeah. The same time, 10 o'clock. So if the, everything going well, then more people are interested, then we'll make a certificate for so planning accordingly. Okay. Build up and have like every year program. See. So, what day will start? We on August 
آگست Only clash with the other one which we planned. We can wind it up maybe with it before that. July 30th we can wind up, 31st we can start. July 31st, okay. Yeah, July 31st we can For August, yeah. August 1st, Sunday. Sunday. Yeah, that's also good. We'll make like a 75th anniversary of India. August 1st. Yeah, we'll go there. August 1st. That means Sunday. So we'll keep it every Sunday. Every Sunday. That way people can go to the church or they can go to the class. <laughs> Bhaul Gira class at the church. <laughs> Listen here. That by mistake you can chant. We are starting our church classes on Bhaul Gira. <laughs> Complain. We had to go to the church, we can all come to the class. You know? <laughs> and now we have we do the live stream. You know? Raj brother is uh, traveling or what? He is walking. Okay. What, Gabriel, you are in uh, silent mode, Manmohan Singh mode? Some work being done in my apartment, so I was keeping on mute, but. Um, just listening to the beautiful conversation and the wonderful ideas. Because we were yeah, just discussing, choice. discussing about going to the church, listening to Bhagavad Gita. You are attending interfaith, listening to some other faith. <laughs> <laughs> so much, <laughs> so much going on. But yes, listening. No, listening actually, the... it should be not interfaith. It should be intrafaith. Wow. Very well said. The interfaith inter is inside your faith. That is spirituality. Uh, that, whether you speak about it or not, it is there inside you. Everybody has got interfaith. Uh, but do you have intrafaith? That's a difficult point. 